Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to be showing you guys which products I have been loving lately. I kind of wanted to do like a monthly favorites video every month, but I feel like I can never accumulate enough products to be able to sit down and make a video and show you guys. So I figured I would just accumulate products and then whenever I feel like I have enough products to talk about, then I'll sit down and do like a current favorites and I will do like beauty, lifestyle, just like random things. I like to, I rather watch like the lifestyle and random things because I can go try out different foods or shoes, whatever, and instead of just like beauty products. So today I'm going to be showing you guys just like random food items and some clothing and beauty. I feel like I have a little bit more beauty than anything else, but um, I'll definitely show you guys a little bit of everything. And I wanted to let you know that this video is in collaboration with one of the most amazing people that I have ever met through YouTube, Hillary Alex. She is pretty much my soulmate, my twin. We have so much in common, it's creepy. We are pretty much the same person. Our sense of humor is exactly the same. And she's just one of the most genuine and real people I have met through YouTube. She and I are pretty much the same person. We have the exact dry sense of humor, which I love. She has this powerful story that if you guys go on over to her channel, you will see what I'm talking about. But this girl is one of the bravest people I have ever met and she's just a beautiful person inside and out and we're pretty much the same person. I know I tend to keep my channel a little bit more PG, but she is very 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 real and honest and raw in her channel so you guys will definitely appreciate that and she will have you laughing i promise you guys will absolutely love her she has become one of my closest 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 friends we constantly text and you guys i'm telling you you guys will absolutely love her and go ahead and check out her channel she's also going to be showing you guys her favorites make sure you let her know that i sent you over make sure that you subscribe to her channel and that you also follow her on instagram i will leave all of her information in the description box below and if you're coming over from hillary's channel hi my name is ali and i have a flight attendant lifestyle and uh, motherhood channel and I will vlog all about the flight attendant life as well as lifestyle and motherhood. I am going back to work in the next few weeks here. So you will see me transition from being a stay at home mom to going back to work and how I balance everything. I hope you guys are here to stay and that you guys are willing to follow me along on this journey. Um, also, before we get started, I wanna let you guys know that I am so grateful for all of the support that you guys left on my going back to work channel or video, I mean, it just, I'm I feel so refreshed to be going back to work and to get all of you guys uh, back on board here and I feel very welcome so thank you guys so much for all of your support and I'm really excited to be able to show you guys the flight attendant vlogs again so um, I, you will see me doing a little bit of lifestyle and a lot of the mommy stuff and cleaning videos and stuff like that until I go back to work so hang in there I will be back with the flight attendant vlogs in the next few weeks so make sure your notification bells are on so that you never miss a video and you know when I upload a video whether it's the flight attendant videos or just the lifestyle videos that some of you guys like to watch so anyway this is the longest intro ever <laughs> so let's just get started I'm going to start off with beauty products and the first thing I'm going to talk about is something that has been life-changing for me I wish that I would have done this a long time ago I love doing my nails at home if you followed me for a while you know how much I love to do my own nails it's just so therapeutic to me and I've been doing it for years and I have been absolutely loving the red carpet manicure LED nail gel polish I get mine at Ulta, but I think you can get them on Amazon too. They're just cheaper to get at Ulta, especially because you can use the 20% off coupon. And sometimes they have like sales like buy two, get one free or buy one, get one 50% off. So I have been stocking up on these. My friend Marisol got me into these. Ever since then, I have been doing my gel nails at home instead of going to the nail salon. And this is going to come in handy when I go back to work because our nails need to be uh, manicured not necessarily like polished but I like to have my nails polished so it's definitely gonna come in handy and I bought this LED uh, lamp 
or is it no uv led lamp on amazon as well so i will leave all of these products down below in the description box in case you guys are interested in trying any of these out i got this on prime day i think and i think i got it for like seven dollars so it's not that expensive and it works amazing so this has been life-changing for me and it's definitely going to save me some money and speaking of nail polish my current favorite nail polish you guys know kale polish is my favorite brand nail polish brand of all time that is my number one favorite nail polish so i am constantly buying any new season or any new collection that comes out i'm buying at least one color so the most recent one that i've purchased is the is um from the fall collection of this year and this is isma it's named after the villain in emperor's new groove if you didn't know but i love that movie so i had to get this and then if you guys want to see a video on how i do my nails with regular nail polish let me know and i can show you what products i use and um pretty much my kale polish collection because i have like my own box for kale polish now moving on to makeup i recently tried out the ColourPop brow boss brow pencil and i don't know why i didn't try this before i have been using the anastasia um brow whiz i have i was using that for years and i was spending 21 dollars on that pencil when i could have just spent five dollars on this thing right here and it is amazing i am in the color brunette and it's what i have on my eyebrows right now and it just it made such a difference i feel personally i feel like it was pretty much the same thing as the anastasia beverly hills one let me know if you guys have tried both and if you agree with um them being pretty much the same i feel like i'm a little bit late on this bandwagon but i recently discovered uh soar by mac the lip pencil and i was actually texting hillary when i was getting this and she said you need this in your life you need to buy this and hillary is the kind of person that if i want to get talked into buying something that's who i'm going to text because she's not going to help me make the rational decision and just say no be smart she'll say you need it necessities we're both a really bad influence on each other when it comes to shopping so yeah i was actually texting her this is her fault right here and she's like you need this you need it it's the best so i got it and i don't know why i didn't get this before i remember was it kylie jenner that made this really really popular i don't know but i finally got it and it's the color that i'm wearing right now and i've been pairing it with another favorite of mine which is the dose of colors a mob story and it is the desi and katie collection oh my goodness i love this and it smells so good it smells so so good and so i got both of these at ulta and i used the 20 percent off coupon for this so it ended up being a lot cheaper and i've actually i've been loving this combo for my lips especially right now in the fall that's exactly what i'm wearing right now so i make sure that this is really sharp and i lined my lips and i fill them in with this and then i also um go over with this uh lip color right here and it just makes this nice combo which i really really like and staying on the topic of lip color i have been loving the nars afterglow lip balm in the shade orgasm i think it's so beautiful this is such a pretty color oh my goodness it's it's very sheer but it's like it's almost like a your lips but better kind of tint so it's perfect for the everyday shade it's perfect for a day where i don't necessarily want to wear this color and i just want to wear something a little bit more subtle it's so moisturizing on the lips and it's kind of pricey for a lip balm but I, I love it i love it so much okay so this next product isn't new to me and i actually stopped using it because it gets really humid here in texas where i live and i try not to look so dewy i like looking dewy but i don't want to look sweaty you know so i stopped using this but ever since i had luca my baby he's four months old i have been more on the drier side and also with the climate change and the weather change i have been more on the drier side which is so not like me so i went back to the Too faced hangover rx Replen replenishing face primer and it is made with coconut milk this is like an old product that has been around on youtube and i used to love this in the winter time but now i feel like i'm starting to use it a little bit more because of how dry my skin is and i had just forgotten how much i love this i have the travel size because i didn't really want to spend 34 dollars on the big one maybe later i will but 
Um, I feel like this will last me a long time. This is, I think it was only $16 for this, which is a lot for a travel size. I know, I know, but I feel like I'd rather spend $16 right now than spend the $34 on a primer. This next product is a hair product. This is the Living Proof Perfect Hair Day in Shower Styler, and this is uh, supposed to enhance texture and shine for air dried styles. So this, oh my goodness, has made such a difference in my hair. This, you pretty much wash your hair like normal and condition it and everything and then you just put it all over your hair and then you just lightly rinse. Then you just go on with your day and then you just let your hair air dry. So I have been dyeing my hair ever since I was 15 years old. My mom's a hair stylist so my hair is pretty damaged. So this thing has been life changing. It's $25 so it's a little pricey. But if you guys can get this, if you have hair like mine, definitely try it out. I love Living Proof. They're one of my favorite hair brands, but I'm telling you this, ugh, I love this. The beauty product I'm going to talk about is this Jo Malone English Pear and Freesia. I think that's how you say it, Freesia. And this is just one of my favorite fragrances of all time. I love perfumes. You can never go wrong with getting me perfumes. George just always gets me perfume for Christmas, birthdays, Mother's Day. It's just, I love perfumes. I love them. I love them so much. But this is this has just been one of my favorites lately because it just reminds me so much of fall and like winter time. It's um let me see what the notes are. Okay, so the notes are King William Pear, Freesia, and Patchouli. And this is like I said, the travel size. It is $68 for this, but this is I think this is my number one favorite Jo Malone fragrance. So if you guys ever go to like Nordstrom or Sephora, ask for a sample and see if you guys like it before you go out and buy it. It's, ugh, it's so good. I love this so much and I'm almost running out as you can see. So as soon as I run out, I'm going to go get one or maybe I'll get it for Christmas. I'll ask. This will be in my Christmas list. Okay, so now I'm going to move on to more of like lifestyle things. So I'm going to show you this pair of shoes right here that I got from Target. I've been really into slip-on shoes lately. And I never really liked them before because I don't like how they make my feet look. I feel like they make my feet look bigger than they are. And I, I'm a size eight and a half, so I'm already really self-conscious about that. And sometimes I have to size up to a size nine, especially after having kids. Um, so these are a size nine and I absolutely love this. They're by the brand A New Day. I got these for $17. They're originally, I think, 22 or 20. 20, 24 I believe and one time I just went to Target and they were just on clearance so I picked them up and they have been the perfect shoes to just put on with some leggings yoga pants and then like a sweater like this thing right here that I'm wearing that I've been living in um, and these have just been perfect so hit up your local Target and see if you can find them I feel like these are a dupe for a pair of Steve Madden's which I really appreciate the fact that Target has a lot of dupes for Steve Madden shoes I love Steve Madden shoes but I can never Never see myself paying full price for a pair of Steve Madden's like I have two pairs of Steve Madden shoes and one I got from thread up and the other I got from the Steve Madden outlet so I cannot pay the full price for Steve Madden shoes so I can really appreciate the fact that Target has a lot of dupes for their shoes the next thing is these key I was gonna call them quays because my husband George makes fun of them and he just calls them quays all the time so I'm so used to calling them quays because of him but um, these are the key, high key <laughs> sunglasses. And these are in the size mini. Sorry, they're a little dirty. I don't know if you can tell, but I love these sunglasses. I had the, the fade ones, but I don't know. I kind of just like these a little bit more. These are polarized, like I said. These are unisex, which I think is pretty cool. So I am always wearing these and you guys are always asking me about these. I got these at Nordstrom they are the like I said the high key mini polarized and I really like the fact that they're unisex and I love the shape of them I also like how they're aviators and they are way more sturdy than Ray-Bans I've had Ray-Ban aviators in the past and I feel like they're just so flimsy compared to these so yeah if you've been on the fence about getting some keys definitely do it I've really been liking these bath and body works um wax melts this is in the scent pumpkin apple i stocked up on a whole bunch of the fall scents a few weeks ago and i ended up picking up this one leaves marshmallow fireside what's the other one that i picked up uh flannel and i just have them in the bath and body works um 
wax melters which i really like them they're not that expensive you can use the coupons on them so i think it's such a steal especially for what they are and the scents last a long time and this one has been my favorite one to melt this one in leaves and this one is like i said pumpkin apple and it just smells so good oh the other one is uh, pumpkin pecan or pecan pecan waffles oh that one smells so good it really makes my house smell like i'm baking a pie and now i'm moving on to coffee and i really i have two coffees to talk to you guys about so the first thing is the starbucks salted coal foam cold brew it is the best coffee starbucks has ever come out with in my opinion if you like coffee like the strong coffee this is what you should get so you can either get the salted one which has uh, i think a few pumps of caramel inside the coffee and then the cold foam is salted so if you guys have watched my vlogs you know that i've talked about this before this coffee perks me up especially because it's cold brew and cold brew is just a, it's just stronger in general so i absolutely love that coffee i get a grande and then i just ask for them to put it in a venti cup so that they add extra ice and the ice lasts longer that's just like the perfect way and i'm an iced coffee person and i just ugh, i love it it perks me up so whenever i have things to do when i have a long list of to do's that is my go-to coffee i go and i buy myself one and i have energy for a long time <laughs> then the next coffee just this is a coffee you can make at home this is the javalia colombian coffee this is just in the k-cup this is my coffee at home i love colombian coffee and i also love cuban coffee but this one is just really good i was really into the donut shop one but i recently picked this up and oh my goodness it's so good it's so strong it perks me up and i paired up with the silk almond creamer in pumpkin spice i'm not a big fan of pumpkin spice lattes like i'll have one maybe once a year but I'm, I'm not really big on them um so this right here is really good and i have cut back on dairy because if you guys have followed me my son uh, my baby has reflux he has acid reflux so i've i've had to cut back on dairy a little bit to kind of help with the spit up situation and this is actually a really good almond creamer i'm not a big fan of almond creamer but this one is really good i'm really excited to try other flavors and see if i like the vanilla or the caramel ones that they have i think they have hazelnut too so i might give those a try once the pumpkin spice runs out and i think it's seasonal so and then the last thing i'm going to talk about is this sweater right here i feel like i talk about this sweater all the time in every video because this is just seriously my favorite sweater at the moment and i feel like i'm going to be wearing this for a long time this is just a long pullover shirt this is the oh my goodness i forgot the name from so i got it from airy and it is called the plush hometown sweatshirt i've really been into plush this fall i just really really like how cozy and the material um feels so i also picked this up in the olive green color which is another color i've really been into this fall and i love how these shirts can be worn with leggings like they'll cover your butt and they'll just they're covering they cover you enough to be able to get away with wearing leggings so if you can pick one of these up especially when they go on sale i feel like airy just has been having a lot of sales lately definitely pick one of these up you guys are always asking me about these too so i figured i would mention them but anyway that is it for my favorites this month or this season i guess you can say let me know if you guys want to keep seeing more favorites i would love to talk about them i feel like i can sit down and talk to you guys and it's like i'm talking to my friends and letting you guys know hey check out this product and check out this shirt or check out you know this coffee let me know if you guys really enjoyed this video make sure you guys head on over to hillary's channel and that you say hi to her and that you subscribe and you check out what her favorites are and then also i wanted to ask you guys something i've been wanting to do like a live video i've only been live on instagram a few times but i'm really shy when it comes to that so i feel like i would much rather do a youtube live let me know if you guys would be interested in that and then i can also let you guys know and kind of schedule that so that you guys can join me and we can talk i can answer some questions and i think it would be fun so thank you guys so much for watching make sure that you subscribe if it's your first time here make sure you turn on your notification bell so you never miss a video and make sure you guys are following me over on instagram and that you give this video a thumbs up i will see you guys over on my next video bye I'm always